Okay, welcome again to this session on quadratic equation, folks. Now, uh, in this uh, session, we are going to take up uh, how to find out the condition that the roots of a quadratic equation ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0 is uh, a equal in magnitude, either first condition is an opposite in sign, and secondly, reciprocals. Okay, so we have to find conditions such that uh, the roots of a given quadratic equation are equal in magnitude and opposite in sign. And second is, uh, what is the condition for them to be reciprocals of each other? So let us take up case A, right? So roots are, are equal and opposite in sign, opposite in sign. So if you see, we have learned uh, that you know uh, the properties of the roots and its relation and their relation with the coefficients so we'll use that in this case so let the roots be let the roots be alpha and minus alpha okay now sum of roots sum of roots of equation ax square plus bx plus c equals 0 is given by minus b upon a. You have, you have seen that in, in the previous sessions. So minus b by a. So now, so root, sum of roots will be alpha plus minus alpha is equal to minus b upon a. This implies minus b upon a is 0. 0. Right? Minus b upon a is 0. So that means b has to be 0 b has to be 0 right so this is the condition so examples so let us take examples so hence examples like uh, x square minus 4 equals 0 in this case if you see x is equal to plus minus 2 isn't it so hence x equals to plus minus 2 so equal and opposite signs isn't it and uh, similarly 2x square is equal to let's say 3 so x square will be equal to 3 by 2 so x will be equal to plus minus under root 3 by 2 so equal in magnitude and opposite in sign so there will not be any term containing x the moment you see such equations you know that roots are equal and opposite what about case b reciprocal roots reciprocal roots reciprocal roots right so let us say roots are let us say roots are alpha and 1 upon alpha okay these are the two roots and we know that product of roots so you'll use this condition product of roots product of roots of equation ax square plus bx plus c equals 0 is nothing but c upon a isn't it so hence we get alpha times 1 upon alpha is c upon a this means c by a equals 1 that means a is equal to c so this is the condition for reciprocal roots guys example example so that means the constant term must be equal to the coefficient of x square so hence x square minus 2x plus 1 is equal to 0 this will have reciprocal roots right similarly x square minus 4x plus 2 is equal to 0 this will also have uh, no this will not have reciprocal roots why because c is not equal to yeah so plus 1 this will have reciprocal roots isn't it and um, similarly let's say a uh, 2x square 2x square minus 5x plus 2 equals to 0 so this will also have reciprocal roots let's solve this and see a is equal to c here can you check yes a is equal to c so hence by this rule the um the root should be reciprocal right so hence let's try to solve this so 2x square minus 4x minus x plus 2 equals 0 so 2x common and hence x minus 2 and here minus x minus 2 equals 0 so hence you will get x minus 2 times 2x minus 1 equals 0 so you clearly see either x equals to 2 or 
x equals to 1 upon 2. So you can see they are reciprocal to each other. So hence it works. So if a is equal to c, we have reciprocal roots. This is the condition. Okay, so this will be very, very effective uh, knowledge for solving uh, questions quickly in a comparative exam.